Hey, so this is my second battle. Um, it was against Blue Assassin, who I happened to run into on the Smoke on forums, challenge him to a battle. He said yes. So, rockin'. Let's get this party started. Um, so I start off with my regular Glade lead. He comes out with a fortress. So I thought I could close combat it to death because I thought it'd be super effective because it's steel, but it wasn't. So he gets down a layer of spikes, and I figure he's gonna throw down another layer, so I taunt him. And he did try, and obviously he's been taunted, so that don't work. Gets leftovers recovery. And then I close combat him again, because I'm hoping, you know, maybe I'll get a crit or something. I can do a decent chunk of damage. But doesn't do enough to kill him, and he gyro balls, or gyro ball, however you say it. And obviously there's a huge speed difference, so that almost knocks me out. But I hang on with Focus Sash. And I figure another close combat won't be able to kill him, so I go for the Destiny Bond. And he uses Bug Bite, so he dies with me. Hooray! So I don't really know what to send out next, so I go out on a limb and I send out my Rhyperior. He sends out Infernape. Now I know it's going to use Close Combat, so I send out my Tangrowth to absorb the Close Combat. But he gets a crit. He gets a bloody crit. These crits always do me in. Every, every time. See, look, a crit. Yeah. You're gonna see, that's gonna come back to haunt me later, most likely. Um, then he does another close combat and I die. I attempted to sleep powder, but he killed me. Obviously, he's faster. So I send out my lantern, and this is unbelievable here. My lantern survived an Infernape's close combat. I, I don't know how. I'm not quite sure how, but he survived. So I got in a thunder wave, which was freaking sweet. And then I get leftovers recovery. And now, thanks to all these close combat special defense drops, one surf is enough to take him out. Which is pretty sweet. Goodbye, Infernape. This is for the win. And then I get lefty's recovery, which brings me to a nice 110. He sends out Starmie. Now, this is pretty sweet. He uses surf, but I absorb the surf easily. And I thunderbolt him back, which is a nice... After Effect, and I think it OHKOs him. Yes, it does. It He's gone. Oh, I get a crit. Okay, so the crits do work in my favor sometimes. That's that's nice to know. And then Lefty's Recovery sends out a Gengar. I can't live. I go for the Thunder Wave anyway in case he misses whatever he's doing, but Shadow Balls me and I die. And he gets a crit. Again. So I send out my Blaziken, and I go for the Overheat. I'm Scarfed, so I actually outrun this one. Boom, the Overheat OHKOs him. So yeah, Bla I like my revenge killing Blaziken, it's pretty good, it, though technically that wasn't a revenge kill, but you get it. So since I've been on, and I switch out to Reginald, my Honchcrow, and here again we see the ever infamous crit. That Surf knocked me out, I probably could have survived one hit, but no, he got a crit. So send out my Blaziken again, and I Thunder Punch him, hoping that I'll get a crit, but it does just about over half. Yeah, a little bit over half. And he gets the Surf, which OHKOs me, naturally. Blaziken is not built for taking hits. So goodbye, Blaziken. Now, sucks that all I've got left is a frickin' Rhyperior, which obviously has four times weakness to Surf. So that is not good. So he Surfs. And I think I survive one more turn, or I die. No, I die. It's super effective four times. Yep, so that's a loss for me. So good battle with him, and um, yeah.